Another incredible journey tonight, this one involving family photographs that appeared lost to history. Dozens of black and white snapshots more than five decades old disappeared from an Edmonton home, but they've been reunited with their rightful owners thanks to a kind and curious stranger with an appetite for antiquing. CTV's Dan Grummet has the story. Barry there, Judy in the middle. Irene Dimitri flips through a family photo album. They're all black and white because that's all we had in those days. Until recently, she didn't know 62 were missing from the collection. I couldn't believe where, who would get them. Where, where would they come from? This is Todd Reshore. He bought a book from a local value village. Scattered in the pages, 62 black and white family photos from the 1960s. A father, John. A little girl, Judy. A mother and her newborn boy, Barry, at an Edmonton hospital. Reshore was determined to find the family and reached out to CTV. The problem? The mother actually didn't write the surname on any of them either. Our story aired, and Irene and her husband John saw themselves on TV. <laughs> it, was, it was fun. Whoops, uh, what do we do? <laughs> Irene says the snapshots belonged to Dorothy, the fifth person in many of the lost photos. My mother-in-law. When Dorothy died 16 years ago, John and Irene inherited them. They were curling, so Irene put the photos in a book to flatten them out. You sort of forget, forget those things, don't you? Two months ago, she decided to donate the book. She didn't think she'd see it again. Come on in. Reshore personally delivering the photos to the same house pictured in them. Irene. Uh, nice to meet you. You're just as good looking as you were back in <laughs> 1960. You. The photos are back with the Dimitri family. John, Irene, Barry and Judy. The find sparked a flurry of memories. You know, I remember when we came out with Barry, because it's the first one. And Reshore, for all of his trouble, gets a keepsake of his own. Well, I think after all you've gone through, I think you deserve the book. You do? Yes, I do. <laughs> <laughs> yes, ma'am. And like each photo found within it, it too now has its own set of memories. Dan Grummet, CTV News, Edmonton.